Hello, thank you so much for coming back to watch this week's Dollar Tree Gold. So today for you, I have another skincare product. It is the Beauty Guru Natural Under Eye Serum. And yeah, I was curious about this. So I've been using it for a little bit and I've got some thoughts. But anyway, if you'd like to see if this $1 eye serum is worth it, if it's safe, how does it go, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, um, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. You can also bookmark the page if you would like to. I mean, I'd appreciate it. I also do a live stream the majority of Sundays at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so come hang out, come chat with me. I really do love getting to know my viewers and subscribers. Okay, so obviously I got this at Dollar Tree, and when I saw this, I'm like, is that an As Seen on TV brand? But it's not done a lot of research, but yeah, this is Beauty Guru Natural Under Eye Serum with C. Buckthorn. And I was looking at it, and and it said something about essential oils. I'm like, whoa, essential oils aren't super great for your skin, you know what I mean? But anyway, this is, yeah, so it has a whole bunch of stuff in it, so let me go in and read you the ingredients. So it does have coconut oil is the very first thing. Has rosehip oil, chamomile oil, sea buckthorn, coffee. Um, it has lemon, um, lemon essential oils, frankincense. So it has lemon essential oils and frankincense essential oils. Yes, they're at the very bottom. So that does mean that there's not a ton of it in there, but still, essential oils on your under eyes seems a little sketchy to me. But anyway, so yeah, we were just gonna. You know, it's 100% natural. Like I said, I've been using this for a little bit, but... So it is nice because it does come in a, like, heavy-duty glass roller ball, okay? And it does smell really, really nice. It just kind of smells like oranges. So what you're supposed to do is just gently roll the roller ball underneath your eye. I personally don't like doing that, and I'll tell you why. So I actually put some on my finger. My hands are clean. So I, the first time I did use this, I did roll. And the thing is, is I don't know if my eyes are just sensitive, but I don't like to put this like right up against my lash line. It felt a little bit tingly and it's probably from, guess what? The essential oils. But I mean, as long as you don't get it right up against that lower lash line, up into like your waterline area, I'm fine, you know what I mean? But yeah. So the ingredients, okay, so the coconut oil, number one, that's an oil, it's gonna really help to moisturize. Rosehip oil does have vitamin C in it. Um, the coffee, of course, has caffeine, so that's gonna help to kind of depuff. So I don't think that this is a bad product at all. I think it's kind of nice actually, but I would be very, very cautious with this because if you have sensitive skin, I would stay far, far away from this. Um, I just don't think your skin would like it. It does say to keep away from children and pets, so make sure that you wash your hands very, very well. I have two cats and yeah, just make sure you wash your hands very well because essential oils can be extremely poisonous to animals. But all in all, I don't think it's a bad under eye serum. Have I seen extreme results with it? No, but as with most under eye cream serum stuff like that, you're not gonna be seeing major results. If you wanna see major results, you're gonna be having to do like, you know, some, some cosmetic procedures to get some major results. But it does feel good. It does help to do to puff for a little bit of time. And even though it's like pretty much straight coconut oil, I don't feel like it's super greasy underneath the eyes. I haven't had any kind of reaction, you know, once I stopped putting it on that one night with the roller, but I think it's a nice eye serum. Um, I think it's worth a dollar. I think if you don't have sensitive skin, I think it's worth looking up. I think it's worth getting. And I do think that this would make a really, really nice gift. So hear me out, hear me out. I know I'm talking a lot about holidays, but it's coming whether you're ready or not but Dollar Tree has these really nice gel eye packs that you put in the fridge can you imagine like that 
with like one of these and like, I don't know, something else from Dollar Tree, beauty related. I think that'd be a really, really nice gift that could cost you three to five dollars depending on how many products you get. So yeah, I think it's definitely worth a dollar. Um, it definitely seems more high end than something I would find at the dollar store. So I do think that the Beauty Guru Natural Under Eye Serum with Sea Buckthorn, I think it's a nice product. I'm going to definitely continue to use it. But yeah, it's, it's, it's a good eye. It's a good eye serum, I think. But anyway, I wanted to tell you guys about this um, just in case you're interested. But it is a Dollar Tree Gold if you don't have sensitive skin. But anyway, there we go. Short and sweet this week. You're welcome. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments if you've seen this at your local Dollar Tree. Have you picked it up? I would love to know down below. And just so you know, I do have a Macari page where I sell discount makeup, beauty, skincare, hair care, all sorts of stuff. I also have a, another YouTube channel where I upload seven days a week all about budget food and I have a little Facebook group where we kind of hang out and chat and stuff. So I'll link them all down below for you if you'd like to check them out. And of course, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all about your client, babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start auto playing here very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a second.